How's it going, YouTube? Pastor Sits here, back with another One Piece card game opening. So today we have a full case, as you can see, of uh, um, Paramount War. It's OPO2. We're going to get into. I actually, this is uh, try number two here with this video because I started the other video and my dog was eating food and just chewing really loud. And I think she's actually back at the dog bowl, but um, I'm just going to go ahead and just go ahead and. Uh, keep going on. She should she should be doing really soon. Weirdly enough, I, I just heard someone say I was watching um I guess uh Joku MD, he's a he's a big One Piece fan. And uh he um somebody said in his chat that I was watching just now that the first four boxes at the top are all leader alts. So these are the top four. So we're gonna see if that's true. Um, we are going to be keeping track of our hits in every box. Um, typically in OP01, you got four boxes that were leader altar, and it also have an alt art in it. Then one box that would have a secret and two alternate arts. One of those alt arts can be a secret alt art as well as the leader alt art. And then a secret uh, box and four boxes that had a secret and one alternate art. So we're going to see if that's kind of still true. Um, well, let's just go ahead and get in here. All right, gosh, so excited. I really, I haven't, I've looked at some of the checklist on this, but um, I honestly haven't, like, uh, I, I got into two of the deck um, deck profiles that I wanted to try out. This is cool. They got the revision pack. Um, pack. This would be all of the uh, post errata, like all the corrections to all the OP01. Most of them is... Uh, I want to say they corrected like 75 cards, but this has 33 types in total. But um, we're going to save that for now. Maybe I'll open one of them, but we do have the uh, box topper. Glad they're doing that again. I don't even know what which bo box toppers there are, but um, so we got nice Boa Hancock. That's cool. That's just, uh, she's just a little bit voluptuous there. That's for sure. But um, anyway, yeah, we'll see if this is a leader leader one so I I kind of feel like that's probably not gonna be true but um, now I will be since the since the boxes are probably kind of laid out um, I'm sure some people will call me out for this but I'm probably gonna open up until I get it looks like we got the uh, sh oh no it's not shanks okay I thought it was the shank um, special dawn that you get one per box um, but I will be opening up uh, until I hit at least three hits. You know, once the box is done with all everything but the super rares, I'm probably gonna save a lot of the boxes, save a lot of the packs for my niece to open up. Um, I'm not gonna be able to see her until like Easter, I think, and I didn't want to open. I didn't want to wait to open up my cases. So yeah. So on the back got the uh, One Piece tutorial app. Kind of cool that they do that. So that way you can kind of like, okay, these are from, you know, this era. These are from this era. You know where the Dons are from, which is kind of a neat thing. So you got Deathwink, Domino, Usopp. I'm kind of going to go slow at first, but then I'll go right to the hits. Full body. Now, I am only on um, episode like around 280. The like, I think it's called the Enus lobby when nico robin i don't want to have spoilers but i mean i figure most people probably assume We've got monkey d arp and luffy kind of cool ones there um so i might get some of the names wrong i don't know all the characters of one piece so if it's uh like for example like anything past like the enos lobby when they're saving um nico robin uh, I pretty much don't have much of uh, much knowledge. I'll, I like the, the the navy ones. That's cool. White beard pirates. I don't know why that why they call him white beard. He's got a white mustache. Inazuma and Haniyabel. Okay, there's one of the um, one per box uh, shanks. Every time I'm in here, my dog starts trying to be. She's like quiet all day, and then as soon as I start recording, and then she decides to be a little butt so looks like we might have something in this one maybe an alt art at most land of wano okay so the decks i'm interested in playing i might play the zora rush deck 
There's some neat cards that make that pretty good. Looks like we might have a alternate art here, and it's going to be Monkey D. Garp. Okay, cool. We'll take that. Luffy's dad, I believe. I don't think he's really... He might be in the... He might have showed up a few times in this show already, but um, I believe he has. But, uh, yeah, so it's taken me a while. I mean, I have a lot. <laughs> it's taken me a few months, like... I've been probably watching since like November um, or November or what? Uh, yeah, November last year. And I'm, and I'm still have a long ways to go. All right. Uh, I'm not seeing a lot of the cards that I want. So, oh, wow. looks like we got another hit already. It's a super uh, uh, ace. Very cool. Take that. I don't know how playable he is, but um, so we'll just do this. All right, we'll just keep kind of everything, everything for this box in one stack. I usually put like stuff up here, but I want to keep track of each box. Maybe I'll once I once I write down what's in, in each box, maybe we'll put up some some nice stuff. So obviously prices right now are just going absolutely crazy on singles it's nuts i mean a lot of these cards are selling for more than op01 is and it doesn't make sense to me there's a nice one right there white beard edward e edward newgate which this is one of the first times i've actually seen a one piece card where it's kind of the um it's shifted it's actually seems quite off centering that's kind of unfortunate i hope that's not a um, a common theme because I like getting it, with the supers I like getting the more popular characters like with OP01 I got Boa Hancock Luffy and um, Zoro I got them all graded and they sell pretty well still have a bunch out on my e eBay store so we got Magellan uh, Honey Eibel and Hina I don't know who that is so yeah so like what i'm into right now is like all the cp9 they're, they've kind of introduced all those guys so yeah necromamushi this is well they just call him cat viper thatch this is what i think he is so i haven't seen really any of the cards that i need for, oh there's one of the one of the cards that i want to use in the um zoro so you may rest this character up to one of your red characters with the cost of one gains plus 300 power during this turn. So the cool thing about that is like if you have Nami the searcher that's a 2001 drop, you can put her down, rest her, give Nami 3000 power, makes her 5000 power, and then put a Don on uh, Zoro and then she goes to 6000 power. So that's pretty crazy. Zephyr and Judgment of Hell, that's pretty crazy. Okay, that's a leader too. That's pretty neat. I need to, uh, you know what? I'm going to separate out the leaders. I meant to do that. You know what? I'll just get, I'll do it afterwards um, and sort everything. I'm just like, this is too much right now. They're opening up six cases is going to take me quite a while. So six cases. I wish six cases, um, six boxes. Yaka... Yasakani secret something okay Zoro Moby Dick Sphinx Mass Deuce and Yamato that's a very good card too on play rest from your opponent's characters with a cost of six or less that's kind of nice so that's going to be a really uh really nice card all right yeah we're going to do it like this that and then I'll start stacking the leaders right there as well and then the Don cards go there. Okay, cool. We got it. We got this. We got this. I'm just kind of anal with my sorting as I open. As, as anybody that watches this channel knows, I kind of do that. Okay. Whitey Bay. Okay, Tony, Tony, Chop, Chopper, Boa, which is the, um, that would be the close up of the box topper. Sea Quake and Monkey D. Luffy. So you don't get leader cards in every pack. So 
there was a chance. I was so upset. I went to the place I play at. Um, we have the uh, the pre-release. Their pre-release event was last night. And they rescheduled it because they were getting their stock late. So I said, okay, cool. They said it's 52 people. So it starts at like 6.30 usually, but it was starting at 7. I didn't join the Discord, which I should have. Um, hold on a second. Let's see what we got here. Oh, Odin. Okay. That's a super. Very nice one there. Very cool. So I show up at like 6 o'clock an hour before it, which I thought it was at 6.30. So it was 30 minutes ahead of time. So I was like, I should be able to get in. It was capped out with 52 people. They had been allowing people to stop by and sign up at like three o'clock in the afternoon. And I didn't know about it because even in the discord, after I joined the discord, they didn't say anything about people doing that. And I was kind of upset. I was, I was kind of looking forward to that. We got Nami. Nice. Now that's not the, uh, that's the super. So there is an alternate art of this. That's really popular. I mean, you got to obviously Nami, you got to have that waifu kind of whole deal. But so if we get a leader in this, we would, we'll probably know that there's, um, we already got the alt art. So we'll see. That guy's creepy looking. Dracul Mihawk. There's a leader of Sanji. Mr. Three and Judgment of Hell. Thatch. All right, let's just go right back. Oh, it looks like we got our first leader. So it is a leader box. Is that um, Ivankov? Ivankov, cool. All right, awesome. Wow, if if that's true that every all four boxes at the top are all leader boxes, that's pretty nuts. Jeez. Okay, so one, two, three, four. Four. so we did get so that's a leader and an alt so let's go ahead and say leader alt art plus alt art and I'm going to save the rest of these packs for my niece to open up or whomever because we should get we should be getting seven more um, or three more we got three supers so we should be getting three more supers in there so she'll have fun with that so that would be cool all right, let's get into the next box. That's pretty crazy. If yeah, if we can, if you can confirm that the top four boxes are all the leaders, that's kind of messed up, though. I kind of feel like. Um, but you know, uh, it's entirely possible that um, you know there'll be, there could be alt arts in this. You know, there could be. You never know. They uh, they might not be the same as they were. In OP01, um, I want to say they probably are. So, I mean, I'm going to watch her open them up anyway. So, if you're getting any alt arts and it's stuff I need, I'm going to give her duplicates. But, you know. So, here we got another booster. Um, box topper is Rosanati. Is that right? Am I saying that right? I don't know. I try to get at least four of every one of the uh, supers. So I have two cases, but quite honestly, if I pull a Manga Ace in this case, I'm probably not going to open up the next one. So that's probably, based on cost, that's the second best leader to pull right now. And it looks like we got Shanks off the bat. Um, all right, we'll put that right there. And I need to mark this. Because you get four boxes with leader alt arts. So Whitebeard's the best one you can get. Ivankov, if I'm saying that right, is the second best one you get, I believe. And then Sanji. But I want to get an Odin. Because um, I want to play him. Got Mass Deuce and Yamato. I think they uh, these cards are definitely off-center. A lot more than OP01. That's uh, kind of uh, upsetting, really. Have to check out that leader art uh, in a second. Looks like we got something shiny in the back here. We got Mr. Ah, I liked him. Okay, so Ivankov. So here's the super. 
of him. Dude, that guy's freaky looking. So let's check out the... Um, that actually doesn't look bad. But see, I get all my stuff graded, so I, I'll, I'll play with the cheapy cards. So, yeah. All right. I can't remember... Wasn't he like... What, what was his power? It was so funny. He would... He could like mimic anyone's power or I can't remember. I'm sure somebody will be able to tell me. It's crazy how many episodes are Tashi. Looks like Nico Robin. All right. We got um, White Beard Leader, which this one, I just don't understand how it's so good. End of your turn, add one card from top of your life cards to your hand. So essentially after like five turns, you have no life cards. That's assuming they don't attack you. Now, you do get six life. So that's a plus instead of five. And you get 6,000 attack. But, I mean, it seems like a lot to give up. But I guess you pretty much just... You're basically attack with... You basically add a dawn and you're already at 7,000. And then you're attacking. They have to counter with like a 2,000 and a 1,000. So... I guess I can kind of see the value in that, but that's pretty nuts. I mean, I don't know. I might have to try that. We've got Luffy and Monkey DR. So they are... Uh, so the correlation in this seems pretty... Like I keep pulling the same cards together. So that's interesting. I do remember that one. Impel Down. Trafalgar Law. Strawberry. Some of the names, man, crack me up. All right, we got Mr. Three. And Kuzan. Uh, is that a... Oh, that's a super rare. Okay. It is an SR. You can see it in the bottom there. Okay, cool. Nice. I like him. We didn't... We didn't uh, I haven't seen that much of him. But uh, obviously turns things to ice. But he was in like an episode or something where he was kind of just... Ended up like freezing Luffy or something. I can't remember what happened, but it was pretty cool. His uh, he's pretty powerful. So I kind of feel like I'm at the part in the um, there we go, Kinemon. That's the the leader card I want. So very cool. I feel like I'm in kind of a part of the episode where like Luffy is like really powering up. Like he just fought this one dude, one of the CP9 guys, and he like kind of started. Like, um, I want to say he went up a gear or two, I think they call it. And he kind of was like steaming. <laughs> it's weird, but it was really cool. We got Marco. I think there's an alt art of that. And then Paradise Tatsuka. Right. I haven't had any alt arts in this one, right? Just supers. Three, two supers and okay. Death Wink. All right. The only thing I haven't really played much is blue. Um, weirdly enough. We got Zephyr. Judgment and Smoker. Now there's a leader Smoker. I do kind of want to play it, have a Navy deck. It's just like, this is the first game I've ever played where it's like, I want to have like multiple decks. So cool. But with OP01, my favorite deck was um, Usus Captain Kid. It kind of sucks. I started playing at like, the place, uh, the place near me, the local game shop that I go to, um, looks like we might have something here real quick. It is Sazazuki, which I think this is a quite expensive card because it's quite good. You may trash one card from your hand, KO up to one of your opponent's characters with a cost of five or less. That's pretty crazy. You're just giving up one card and you can trash that's nuts. It's kind of cool. We've gotten all the different supers than we did in the first one. But so anyway, like I was saying, you know, people have been playing since like December. I didn't start playing in my, the LGS I found until like a month and a half ago. So yeah. Um, so that kind of suck. But you know, I played for about a month, but it was all useless Captain Kid. Excuse me, my dog is. got a bone and it's just going to be annoying so she's looking at me like what are you doing daddy you just took it from me 
And now she's over trying to get it. Death wink. So I only got to play for realistically about... Oh, looks like we got another leader. Man, they are right with this. Is this Sanji? Or Odin? Nice. Odin. Okay. Dude, this is crazy that the top four boxes, if they're all leaders, that's nuts. Because you could essentially just open the top four. You know you have all the leaders and then kind of messed up in a way because i mean everybody wants the leader alternate art so they're most pop they're the most expensive so she's looking at me like you took my bone what's going on daddy it was just funny because she has like 10 of them around the house so she could just go and get get one somewhere else if she really wanted to but dogs don't think like that i guess they don't reason that out land of wano yeah, so anyway, been having fun playing Usus uh, Captain Kid. I love that deck. But so it looks like we got, okay, uh, that's a super. Uh, Borsalino. And hold on. Is that a duplicate? We didn't get a Borsalino in the first one, right? No, we didn't. Wow, okay. I want to say there's like 10 supers. Sound about right, maybe. Eight liters. Uh, and you get an alternate order of all them. I don't know if there... I think there's alternate arts of every super, but we'll see. We got Sanji. That's an interesting one. It's green and blue. There's actually a blue Luffy in this that uh, is really neat. And I think it's actually the alt uh, art there. I want to say that's the, for the super. Now, if we could pull the alt art before all the packs, my niece will have more to open. Smoker and Magellan, super rare. So there's another super rare. Wow. She's uh, my dog's kind of antsy because um, it's been raining here, so I haven't, I didn't get a chance. I wasn't able to take her to the park, so she's kind of. Being a little stinker. We got Monkey to Garp leader. Very cool. Shiki and Kobe. I don't think I've seen those. So I'd like to hear in the comments. What do you, uh, what's everybody, what deck is everybody going to play? And as I was saying, I'm probably going to start off with the Rush deck with Zoro and then also play Odin, which, whoa, that's kind of cool. Okay, that's just a leader. Oh, wow. That just looks weird. Like there's, I guess there's a border, but it's all the smoke and stuff. That's kind of cool. And those two seem to always be together. Yeah, because I, I like playing Usus Captain Kid to the Odin deck if that's kind of meta and will compete. Um, definitely going to play that, but just because I'm not a big fan of like some of the, I like some of the Wano cards. I don't like to have to, I don't like having to play two searchers. So like playing Momo and uh, Jewelry Bonnie kind of sucks. Um, I don't necessarily like it, but we'll see. I hope this is Whitebeard. I think it's an alt. No, it's a green card, so it's gonna be... Okay, it's a super. Man, that art, I feel like that should have been the alt art. That art is nuts. There's a lot going on there. So we really want to get the white beard leader and Sanji would be the ideal ones for the next uh, for the next two boxes. But we'll see. That really sucks if that's true. Brooke. There we go. So where I'm at in the story, Brooke is not in it yet. But um, my sister did tell me kind of his whole kind of like story. She was kind of just telling me about One Piece and about some of the characters, Ivan Koff. And, all right. And just kind of just telling me some stuff. And, wow, I think we're going to go down to the last two packs to get this last one. I guess my niece isn't getting, uh, oh, wait, we might have it here. I guess she gets one pack from this box. And no, I think that's a super. Yeah, it is. It's a uh, white beard, which, again, the, um, the centering just sucks on these. 
That's really unfortunate. So there should be an alternate art here. Unless I missed it. I'll see if they... That's kind of interesting. Last pack. Kind of sucks, really. Less, less packs still have. And it looks like it's going to be a purple. It's Borsalino. Okay. That is sick looking. That is really cool. All right, so we got leader alt art plus an alt art in that one. And our second leader in there. All right, let's go to the next one. All right, we're going to push these back here. That's going to be fun. I have like, I'm not kidding, with all the stuff that I collect, it's just absolutely just getting insane. I really have to, I really have a problem. Um, but I'm trying to focus on F1 soccer and one piece but soccer just there hasn't been anything good to open for so long um maybe maybe the uh maybe don it comes out in a little bit but let's see what we got the promotional pack is going to be boa hancock again all right so you'll get 12 of these in a case all right let's see if we get another leader it kind of like I'm kind of not really liking that. I mean, people could just grab the top four boxes. They know they're the leaders. And then the rest of the box, you know, I mean, there's still good stuff on other boxes. But let's be honest, the leader all arts are realistically what you want. So you could open up the top four boxes, get the leader all arts, maybe get a manga ace in there. And then could you imagine that would suck. I mean, that would be awesome to open it. But it would suck that that could be, you know, people are like, they could do that and then just sell the other eight boxes for, you know, whatever $250 that they're going for right now. And, uh, I mean, there's still be good stuff in them, but they know there's no leaders, which is, you know, the more valuable. And it did I, I swear I pulled him first in like every, every box so far. So actually, let me look here. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So seven super rares. So yeah, that's that's pretty much about how um, about how uh, OP01 was. I think you got seven supers, and then either of the the three box types. So might have something here. Uh, that's just a leader of uh, white beard, which I like the fact that it's like Edward Newgate. That's kind of cool. I, re I hopefully I can find some supers of him that are more uh, centered because I'd like to send off some to PSA. They're still they're doing their fifteen percent uh, or fifteen dollar TCG special crocodile. And it looks like we might have something here, and it's gonna be. Ace, super. So far, I think it's just the uh, just the white beard seems to be off center on those supers. I'll have to check others as we go. But Blue Glory, Moby Dick. Yeah. So where I'm at in the story, like I don't even think they have the new ship or anything because they're like basically they just they ran into um they basically were just like you know uh oh your ship sucks we can't fix it and then all of a sudden cp9 is like okay we want the blueprints and there's just a lot going on but i had to fast forward some stuff with um nico robin crying all the time it was getting kind of annoying jozu and carrot but my sister said it's really important to the story um, and why she joins the crew and everything. So I had to like tough through it. Wanda. Okay. All right. I need to go through here a little quicker. Jozu and Ivankov. Because we got, we're only, we're not even three boxes in. I'm always like leery when it gets to be like an hour. So I want to get through this in like two hours. I don't want to go fast, but also Zephyr. 
Leader, carrot, gum gum rain. Okay. All right, we got let's see gum gum rain and Nami. Okay, another super rare, and that definitely centering looks really good. I think that would be a good choice to grade. Nami, very popular character, and there's like some fuzz there or something. Probably my dog's hair. Ah, she fell asleep. Good. Good. Uh, Hina. Then you guys just get so many Dawn cards. It's almost like depressing reading that, going out to Reddit and just hearing people just, they're just complaining so much about this game. And I get it, but I know you want to play it. I know you want the cards, but you just... New games like this, man, people are going to jump in. They're going to, like, people are trying to profit off of it. I mean, it looks like we got a leader here. And I think this is one of the worst ones to get. No, Zephyr. Okay. Nice. I want to say Zephyr is actually pretty. Um... Wow, that's crazy that that's true. All four top boxes, leaders. So hopefully we get. Well, I mean, I have a second case. So. If I don't pull Manga Ace in this, so we got, let's see, Odin again. What was I talking about? I can't remember now that I have to uh, write it right as I pulled that old art or that uh, leader old art. So, um, oh, well. Yeah, oh, that's right, Reddit. So, yeah, it's just like people are just so mad. I mean, I get it. Cards are hard to get, but... When stuff comes out like this, you got to be on it. Like right now is when you should be pre-ordering OPO4. Like I already pre-ordered my two cases from two different places. So that I had not pre-ordered at before. So hopefully they're okay. But I actually got these two cases for $750 a case. Yeah, crazy. And they're selling for $2,300 now. If I was really smart, I'd be selling these. But, you know, it's okay. I don't need the money. Marco and you get okay. Oh, dang it. All right, let's see if this one. I don't know. Maybe maybe they're supposed to be like this. I don't think that's off center. I think it's just the way the card is with how they did it. I don't know. It'll cost me $15 each, but I'll probably go ahead and send it. I don't even know the alt arts that I want out of this. This is what sucks. I, I know all the leader alt arts, but I don't really know the other ones. So we got Sazuki. Obviously the Nami. You want the Nami. Um, I think there's a Luffy. Um, but it's like. But see, that's the other thing. If if people are going to like the to me, the boxes with the leader alt arts are sometimes the worst boxes you can get because you really only get two hits. I mean, you do get the supers, but... Um, so, like, if somebody wanted to sell them, uh, you know, open those four and then sell the rest, well, there's four boxes in there. They're going to have two old arts and a secret in there. So that would be kind of silly, to be honest, to do that. But, you know, whatever. Oh, that's the first time we hit that. Monkey D. Luffy. Very nice. There's got to be 10. There's got to be 10 then. Supers. Because there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And then. All right. Well, I'm, I need to open. I can't. Can't be wasting time. I think there's 10. There's got to be 10 supers. All right. We got little Sadie. It's like. Don't tell me these boxes are mapped. Because if there's a, if there's, there it is. Okay. All right. Who's this? It is nice. Buggy. Sweet. One of the ones I wanted. I like him. I think he's funny. Very, very funny character. Very cool. All right. So that's three packs for my niece. Awesome. So we were able to, I was afraid it was going to be in the last pack. Actually, I was going to open the next pack I was going to open up was going to be the last. Uh, and actually, hold on. Let's see. I don't think. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I don't know. That sucks. There's actually no hits in those three packs, so that kind of sucks for her. Um, oh, well. At least I'll have fun opening them up, you know. I'm going to give her a full set of the supers anyway, so it's all good. It's all good. All right, so I wonder if these uh, serial numbers mean anything. There's a serial number on the box. I'll show you in just a second. So I wonder if like this one, and it's like one four five one two one one two. I wonder if like the other boxes, because all these boxes have that number. So I wonder if that's like the leader, like the serial number for the leader box, and you know what type you're gonna get. So let's get through this. Douglas Bullet. We got Yamato, and okay, so that's different. Yamato was with that other character before. I can't remember the name of it, but that's kind of cool. Hopefully that's kind of changed up some. So we got Sanji. So the last leader, I would like, obviously would like to get Whitebeard. I mean, he is the most expensive. I'd be okay with Sanji. Um, but honestly, I just, I'm glad that, well, I don't want to say it right now. Never mind. Jozu. Okay. So I'm in the next case. Ooh, we got, is this one of the secret alts? I think it is. It sure is. It's Uta secret alt art. So there's that, which is interesting because it almost looks like a leader. Oh, that's textured. That's very cool. Wait, no, that's just a secret. I'm pretty sure that's just the secret. So I guess the top four are not, um, I didn't think you could get. All right, well, I guess we'll see. We got Carrot and Sazazuki. Well, I guess the. I didn't think you could get a secret in the leader boxes, unless it's an alt art. And I'm. I, maybe that's the. Is that a secret alt art? I don't know. Okay, well, we'll see. Muki and my, oh, there's that. Cool. I have a full page usually of these. I have a like a top deck um, uh, binder that holds like a thousand cards, and it's like it's it's sixteen per page. So I usually load it up with all this stuff. All right, looks like we got another white beard. Yeah, Mister Three and Judgment of Hell. Whew. What a way to spend a Friday night. Monkey D. Garp. Which I'm interested to see how he's got, like, I'm trying not to uh, get any spoilers. And, you know, it's like, all right, I know the ace passes, unfortunately. I do know that. But um, it's just interesting that, like, him and his brother, you know, they're pirates. And then... Their dad's in the Navy, so is he going to be chasing them? Like, interested to see how that all is going to work out. Sengoku and Marco. I know Marco has a uh, alternate, but I don't know him in the game at all. So, I mean, in the cartoon. So, all right, we got Monkey D. Luffy again. Very cool. Super. That is a sick card. I love that. Like, Luffy's always on fire, it seems like. So I'm interested to see what happens with his powers. Because, like, Ace is, like, the fire deal. And now now Luffy. But, okay, Event Cough. So Ace can control fire. Luffy's the rubber guy. But then he's going to do fire. Like, what? Which kind of started in, like, what I'm watching now. Because... He's like doing that. He's like getting into a new gear and he's like, he's like, like almost steaming. That's kind of cool looking. All right. Let me move these back. Maybe that is the secret alt art. Gosh, why didn't I look that up? Well, I'll figure it out by the end of this case. Cause whichever one, whichever version I get like three or four of is usually going to be the one that, uh, that's the one that, um, Oh, I forgot the box topper. 
Let me open that up really quick. That is, okay, squared. It's a new one, good. All right. I'll probably upload this um, and then upload the second half and then do like a, like a recap at the end of everything. And we got nice. That is one of the ones I wanted. Sweet. White beard, alternate art. Oh, that is gorgeous. That's so cool. That dude's been through some battles. He's got some, uh, got some, um, bullet holes there or something all right so we really don't know this is probably not a leader box then so maybe the top four are not leader boxes because that's two alt arts or or a secret and an alt art so we'll see i think we're gonna be open up all the packs in this one I did hear that if you get a manga ace, it replaces one of the secrets, not one of the alt arts. It was really cool. That always sets me off because it's like, it's really weird looking. That's like not because of all the smoke. It's not a border. And I stupidly bought a smoker winner for like $300 thinking, oh man, it's just going to keep going up and up because of the Luffy. And then next thing you know, they're like $120, which I bought several of them at that. So I don't feel so bad and I'll get them all graded. But I was like, idiot. I almost, you know, that was on me. A lot of people would probably cancel the order on eBay. You know, that was on me. So we got a Nami. Very cool. So we should have another alt art in this box if it's if that is a correct and it's odin if this is a correct like you know secret if that is actually a secret i should have looked that up Dang it. but i swear it was that that's the that's the regular secret and the alt art is kind of more of a is a different picture obviously but this could be one of those boxes with just a secret and an old art though. We got Kinemon. Buggy. Now I keep saying Odin. It's uh Kinemon. Is that also Odin? Like the O D E N guy? Did I have that do I have that mixed up? I mean I'm not that I'm not that far into the story, but where he shows up, uh, we got, looks like a super, uh, Borsalino. Now I will say like from OPO one, it just seemed like you got so many duplicate, um, alt arts. That was really annoying thing about it. And looks like we may have something here. I think it's an alt art of Magellan. Nice. All right. So that, that box definitely was, the secret and two alt arts and i can confirm that the top four boxes are not all uh leader but it's kind of weird that that three of them were so we got the uta edward newgate white beard and magellan so very cool all right we're gonna keep these back here for now and then we're gonna mark that as secret plus two alt art all right so two more boxes uh, we're gonna open up and then I'm gonna take a break and get something to eat so I uh, so the serial numbers I guess don't mean anything because so far they all had the same serial number and three of them were leader and one was the other one so yeah maybe i'll I, maybe i should open up one of the revision packs just to just to kind of show and i'll uh i, I do want to put a bunch of the extra packs in um one of these boxes now the thing is i won't get a lot of extra packs anyway because the only with the only pack that I know that like as soon as I hit the leader another Rosinante as soon as I hit the leader and the alt art 
I, I can save those packs for her, but everything else I don't really know until I get four boxes that have all of the um, four boxes that have all of the I'd have to get the four boxes that have the two alt arts and the secret because otherwise I don't know when opening up a box if it's going to have two alt arts or um, the secret two alt arts and a secret or uh, one alt art and a secret all right another new gate and I think it's pretty much clear that um, those cards are supposed to be that way. Unless they all were printed that way. So I'd be interested to see what um, PSA does with that. Because sometimes they'll just print cards that way where they're not. I mean, it's centered, but not like, you know. But I don't know. Maybe they're just all off print. That could be it too. So, all right. Let's see what we're going to get in this one. A lot of these packs, the cards are kind of. We got, looks like we got a super mass deuce and Nami. Nice. I'm liking that. We can, t we've had a Nami like in every box, haven't we? I mean, that's pretty good. If you hit a Nami in every box, you're doing pretty good because she, she sells well. And we just need the alternate art. Yamato and Mr. Bond. Mr. Two, I guess. Is it Bon Bon? That's the kind of the... He was like the flamboyant one. Like he, uh, They do have some really interesting powers. And everybody has a different power. That's just crazy. So uh, apparently there's like... Was it one fruit for each power? One of the devil fruits. So like... Luffy ate the gum gum. Obviously, because he's rubber and gum makes sense. Uh, I can't remember a lot of the other ones, but it's it almost seems like, you know, like the guy I just fought ate, ate something that like he could open up doors and like teleport. It's pretty crazy. It's kind of neat. I guess I uh, annoying my dog. She just got up and like, all right, you're being too loud, Daddy. She leaving. Kobe. From the navy so he looks pretty fast so opening up all this makes me want to watch some more shows today i did watch a few but um vista which really good in the red deck and uh borsalino part of the navy deck i'm not much for playing um the dual colors I did make a uh, law deck, and I plan on playing him some. Is that another Edward Newgate? No way if it is. If it's another white beard. It is. Wow. Two. That's crazy. That's one of the like best alt arts to get, too, because he's very, very playable. Guys, he's absolutely nuts. He's like up to on play up to one of your leaders gains 2000 power until the start of your next turn. So you play him, your leader gets like, say your leader is white beard. He's 6,000. Then he goes to 8,000 and he's 8,000 in the next turn too. Then you can add life cards to your hand using your own effects during this turn. Oh, you cannot. So you don't have to add the life cards to your hand from him. So you can basically stop white beard from taking life cards that's pretty crazy dawn times two when attacking ko up to one of your opponent characters with three thousand power or less so i mean it's not bad but dang we'll take that that's not a bad duplicate to get i'm okay with that we actually got um and i opened up when i opened up three cases of op1 it's crazy that i was able to do that like before they went crazy in price and I pulled every card in alternate art or leader alt art except King and then I pulled King I bought like five loose boxes I think they were about 150 and I was gonna keep them all sealed and then I decided to open them up and pulled like two Kings out of them I don't think they were from the same uh, case because usually you don't get two leaders that are the same that's what I was gonna say earlier and I don't want to jinx myself and get them but 
that's uh i think it'd be kind of messed up if you did get duplicate leaders unless it's like a good leader obviously but i kind of want you know i mean ideally i would like to have nice shanks alt dawn um ideally i would like to have you know in a perfect world in my two cases i would pull you know four different Four different leaders in each one, but the odds of that happening are pretty slim. We got Monkey D, Garp, Leader, and nothing else. So we've just got an alt art in this so far. So could be a leader box. Could be any box right now. I've seen so many people pulling manga aces. It's nuts. But I mean, that's just the way it is. Like people are always going to post when they hit something big like that, but then they don't really post when they don't hit. So, but I just recall on Reddit and Reddit's gotten a lot more people. That's true. But it just seemed like every pre-release event, somebody was pulling a manga ace out of a case. It was nuts. But I still think it's like one in three. Um, that's what I kind of, that's but I pulled mine in the third box of my first case and then I didn't pull another one but you know so hopefully we can pull them because I don't want to spend the $900 for them maybe he'll go down I kind of feel like he will because so many people are pulling him right now it just seemed like every um, we got a monkey be Luffy Every event, it just seemed like somebody was pulling. Now, the uh, pre-release event I was supposed to go to last night, and I wasn't able to. I'm still upset about that. So I'll make sure for pre-release three, I'll be in the Discord to get the information and then show up like early in the day and sign up. We got a Magellan. That one always looks weird to me. Like I kind of missed that as a super, but but I think they had they had 52 people and they all got six packs. So that's odd how they, oh, it's odd that they did 52, but you figure six packs. So that's, that takes care of 24 people per case. So they had two cases and a little bit more and Ooh, we got, okay. So this is another secret of Uta. Nice. So they pretty much had like two cases plus two more boxes and a guy got a uh, ace. So I think it might be two and, okay, Brooke. And Emporio Avonkov. I'm interested to see what that guy's all about. All right, so if we get another alt art, then we know that uh, we can save some packs. Come on. Or this might be one of those uh, secret and all They're like, in my opinion, the worst case is the worst box you can get because you only get two hits. But it is what it is. Vonkoff, Monkey to Garp, Mister Three. All right, let's uh, let's move this back here. Sorry, my hairy arm. All right, last two packs. I have a feeling this one's going to be a uh, a one and one secret and alt, and it looks likely. So we'll have one more box. I feel like we haven't got a lot of alt arts. I guess that's because we've had three boxes with the leader, and unfortunately, this is one of the boxes with the um, just a secret and alt art. So we've got two wait three boxes with leader alt arts one with a secret and two alt arts and one with a secret and an alt art okay so last box of this opening because uh the last time it, it it started over at one hour and like 30 minutes it was really weird and it just started a new video it was like Maybe, maybe it just maxes out at that. I don't know. Revision pack. All right. And I'm going to kind of save one of these boxes to make it look better for my niece. 
My sister likes one piece as well, so I'll let her open up some too. But uh, we're actually going to open up. Okay, box topper. And all right, Tashigi. Cool. That's a different one. And then I'll show you guys. Uh, I'll open up one of the revision packs so everybody can kind of see what that's like. So what they did is they just corrected all the text. Um, like a lot of times it'll say like up to, but like, see, that would be a foil card, but that one's not foil. So now it says uh, counter. Uh, they did like this up to. So now it's like rest one of your opponent's Dawn cards. It should be, they added up to pretty much on a lot of them. Return up to instead of return one character is I think the way it is. So it's like this used to be KO one of your opponent's rested characters will cost three less killer, which is awesome card. Um, which the cool thing is some of these I think are in this. I want to say killer was in the starter deck, right? Yeah, he was STO2. So that's kind of cool. Wait, are these all starter deck cards? Oh, well, that's cool. I didn't realize that. For some reason, I was thinking it was the OP01 ones. Okay, so they're going to correct all the OP01 cards in the actual... That's kind of neat. In in the um, in Wave 2, which I think that's why that it's such a delay. It looks like we have a secret right off the bat. That's crazy. Nice. Uta. And... We don't have a secret of Kuzan yet, do we? That's kind of weird. He's the other one, I believe. But we did get a super of him. Wait, was that a... That wasn't a secret, was it? I need to look at that real quick. Hold on. All right. I know it's in here somewhere. So maybe it was a secret. Could have been a secret all. Wasn't that one? Which box is that? Was it box two? This is I get for like. That's a secret. Where's the? All right, I'm really confused now. Maybe that is the alt art of the super, like that one right there. I don't know if it is or not. I guess we'll see. Whatever. I just want to track what's in each box. So, all right, continuing on. I'll figure it out. If we pull another Kuzan secret, then we'll know. So that, well, what was the alt art in that? box uh all right i'm definitely missing something here i'm very confused now there must have been a, there was an alt art something because we did get the leader we got the kinemon all right well oh well all right we got gum gum rain and little sadie I'll do a recap of these six boxes and then I'll do a full recap at the very end. But, uh, ooh, is that Luffy? No, it's Suzuki. I just saw the fire. I guess he's a fire guy too for the Navy. That's sick looking. That art looks so good. That is so cool. I love the art on these cards. It's like. And we got a, it would really suck. Like it really suck if I pull, if this is a secret and alt art box and I have to go through all of these packs to check and see if, um, I guess I could just save them, but I don't really want to do that. Uh, as long as she has a couple packs to open up, she'll be fine. I, I find it hard to believe that I would pull them both like right off, but you never know. Where are you, Manga Ace? Come on, show yourself. Yeah, a lot of these cards at the top are getting bent because of the, the top and bottom card are like, it's kind of really weird. 
I don't like it. Okay, so it must be the secret. Um, no, that's a super rare. It says super. All right, I'm gonna, I, I, I have to look at this real quick. To figure out, I missed something. I definitely missed something. So there's Kinemon Leader. Oh, that, is that? Okay, that's the old art. Okay. All right, because, yeah, that's the secret. Okay, cool. All right, we got it. We got it. We're good. We're good. All right. So that's just a super. That doesn't make sense. I thought he was a secret as well. So there would be a secret. A, eh, all right, we'll see. I'm very confused now because I thought he was one of the secrets, but he's a super rare, a secret, and he has a secret alt art. That seems kind of weird if that's the case. I mean, I guess it's completely different than like, because you had Shanks was a secret and they had an alt art and they had the manga, but in this one, Ace is a super rare and then he's also a... Uh, the manga so very odd very odd so if we do pull another alt art at least we know that there's a smoker and mass deuce yamato those two are going together again i remember that oh, that's a cool nico robin card on case have the manga ace what's this it is okay it is an ace but it's not the manga ace i mean you can like it's easy to tell when you when you've got the manga it's easy to tell i just wish i had it on camera whenever I, like when i opened up my first case of this i didn't uh, record anything I was just opening up I, I wasn't going to open up one piece on the channel I was just going to keep it like sports and you know like F1 and soccer and stuff but I was like I'm really into this so why not Meteor Volcano and Ivankov the super alright I have a feeling this is a one and one which sucks Monkey de Garp and Nami. Another Nami. I have to go back and check and see how many Namis we got. That's crazy. If I can give her about a box to open up, that'd be perfect. So, all right. Mr. Three. Crazy to get like the two big hits. Like, really. Oh, wait. That uh, might be something. And it's a uh, Monkey D. Luffy. Nice. That is sick. That is really, really sick. That's so cool. I love that. That is uh, That art is awesome. Okay, so that gives us a secret and two alt arts. All right. So, we can save these packs. So, she's almost got a full box. Very cool to open up. So, that was... Oh, crap. What was the other one? It was a secret. That was five, one, two, one, two, three, four, five, six. That was six boxes. Six plus. All right. What was this other one? What is this? Secret. All right, so let's recap these. We have one box had a secret, two alt arts, Monkey Luffy and Sazuki. And then the next box five had Whitebeard, Secret Uta, and nothing else. Then 
box number four, Secret Uta, Whitebeard, and a Magellan alternate art. Sickness. And then box number, what is this, three? Had Zephyr Leader and Buggy. Still very cool. And then box number two had Kinemon Leader, Alt Art, and Bursalino. And then box number one, we hit this really quick. It was the uh, Leader of Ankov and Monkey Dogart. So very cool. Very happy with that one so far. So hopefully we should have, if that's the case, um, we should have, what is it? That was a secret plus two alt arts. Wait, no, box three was, oh, I forgot to write them down, didn't I? Dang it. That's what happened. Box three was leader alt art plus secret plus alt art. Okay. So we've got three of our leader alt arts. Uh, two box two boxes with one alt art and a secret and one box with the secret and two alt arts so that's actually pretty cool we have three boxes left out of the six it should have a secret and two alt art if, if like everything matches with what happened in um opo1 so all right i'm gonna get this uploaded and uh get some food and then i'll be back hopefully both we should have both videos up tonight so you don't have to wait for a full recap. I um, really apologize that I'm doing it in two different videos, but I don't want to lose anything. So thanks for watching. Uh, please like, subscribe, and I'll see you all in part two of this video.